Hello everybody and welcome back to the Moldy Worm Gaming Channel. My name is Troy and today I have moved into my uni room. Well it was actually yesterday on Sunday 27th. Um, today is Monday. This video probably isn't going to come out till tomorrow which is Tuesday. But anyway, I have now moved into my uni room and as I promised in my moving to uni video I would do a room tour for you all. So I'm in my new uni accommodation so let's get to it. Okay we're going to start at the door because obviously that is the best place to start. That's the front door right there. We've got the bathroom which is just right here so let's go into the bathroom and have a little look. It's got automatic lights so when you open the door the lights just come on automatically. I've obviously gone for the green towels and the green floor mats to match and we've got all green utensils over here but we've got a nice sink and obviously the mirror. Um, we've got obviously the toilet. It's all just fairly standard bathroom stuff. We've got a nice shower there with these uh, folding doors so nothing fancy but you know it's good enough and we've got some hanging space over here just by the front door and a little mirror right there and then I've got my shoes just down there and then this is the main part of the room which is just over here we've got a window over there which does open and we've got a nice view I've got my bed over here we got some uh, just some general stuff down there and then I've got my wardrobe which is just right here and that obviously has all all of my Hawaiian shirts in and we got plenty of drawer space which is nice so I can fit a lot of stuff in there then we have got a desk space it's kind of got this little kink here so this main part of the desk I've set my computer up here obviously got my gaming controller and things um, but yeah we've got the computer set up here this is all good to go so I can edit this video and any other videos I make and then this is just some more general storage space down here let me just move I brought my chair yeah um, we've got some more general storage space down here this is more for your books and things but because I've just started don't have any books so we can't really do that but I've got my sack of spuds down there we've got some cereals bread and then this is like the treat section we got sweets and things down there and then I've got all my camera stuff in there we've got a spare chair we did have a desk chair but I wanted to bring my own from home and um, so I'm just using that to put my clothes on which is what's well, good enough to be honest it's just something then I brought my cupboard from home uh, you might have seen this in a couple of my videos this is like gaming storage so I've got some drawers and doors and things and in there I've got like movies and things I brought my Xbox and my PlayStation we've obviously got the TV for all of that and then a uh, washing up basket is just there we've got some baking stuff in here and just general supplies that's just going to live there I might tidy that up a bit more later um, and then we've got some like cleaning stuff we've got some more cooking stuff and then we've got the beds just there with my teddies in um, so not a massive room but it is quite nice we have got a nice view out as well so the river is just down there in that little gap it's kind of a canal actually there is canal boats so if out there we can open the window but I'm not going to because it's really noisy and then down here is that sort of the main gate just there. The reception is just like down here in this building, just down there. Um, and then we've got a little shop just there. So that's all nice. And um, the washing and laundry stuff is all down there. And they're building a new building, I guess, across the road. But yeah, it's... Um, not a massive room but it has everything that you need so let's just go to the kitchen and have a look at that and here we go this is the kitchen again automatic light so don't have to worry about any of that they come on when you open the door. We've got the fridge over here. 
we've got plenty of space in the fridge. I've kind of claimed the bottom. Someone else has claimed the top. And then we've got a freezer just down there. We've got the blue recycling bin and just general rubbish bin. We've got plenty of cupboard space. We've obviously got the sink and the microwave and the kitchen. I've claimed this cupboard right here and that's my slow cooker. And then over here we kind of got like a little sitting area. We've got a couple of sofas and a little desk there. We've got another TV and we're lucky enough to have a remote. Apparently not many of the rooms actually have a remote. They seem to have gone missing but we do have one so that's nice. And then um, we've got another window over here with a nice little view out onto the staff car park. But anyway, um, at least we do have a window for a bit of light. And then we've got the sort of sitting area over here um, where we can have breakfast. And then we've just got a pin board here. It's got a few notices on and all that good stuff. So that's the kitchen. Let's go down now and uh, have a little wander through the city to the actual uni. And here is the actual university. Now I didn't really want to do a voiceover while I was walking because one, it was quite windy and two, people giving me a lot of uh, strange looks as I was walking around with a camera. So I decided to just come back in my room as I'm editing this, um, just do the voiceover. But you can see there's uh, loads of nice little grassy areas. There's a canteen. Um, uh, the building where I'm going to be studying is just there on the left, kind of a strange looking building, but really cool inside. Um, I'll hopefully try and get some footage for you of the inside of that, maybe in a couple of days um, when I actually go into the building. Um, but yeah. And there we go, that's a little tour of the campus and a little bit of look at the accommodation. The building just behind me here is actually the building I'm going to be studying in. Uh, so that should be really cool. It's a nice looking building. I've been for a little look around on one of the open days sort of last year and it's a really nice building so um, it's going to be plenty to do. This week's going to be a little bit boring but yeah I'll keep updating you and um, that's going to do it for this video. Thanks all so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.